one of those unique opportunities I've had since I've been at ESPN for five years. We've opened up the season here. This will be the third in Portland. So Portland's become a little bit of my second home kicking off every Major League Soccer season. And rightfully so, this year I think it's going to be the best one. There's a reason why they call it Soccer City USA, even though I grew up in St. Louis and I take a little problem with that because obviously there's other cities, but Portland deserves it. This atmosphere, this crowd, this city embraces the Timbers and uh, rightfully so they're hanging a banner. Well, anywhere in the Pacific Northwest. I mean, there's a reason why Cascadia Cup is so big. Vancouver, Seattle, those two stand out. Sporting Kansas City has really turned it around. We're talking about a team that used to play when I was playing at Arrowhead Stadium in front of 4,000 people. 3,000 of them were my cousins. Now they're playing in a gorgeous stadium in Sporting Park, Orlando City. Uh, even though it's a baseball stadium, Yankee Stadium for New York City games is big time, Red Bull Arena. There's about 12 to 13 game day experiences that are really big, but it's hard to argue with this one. If I had to pick one to play in front of as a home team, I think I would have played in front of Portland. Uh, smart. Uh, calculated and also the first time for Caleb Porter that he's made moves where he didn't need to go after stars he needed to go after depth he brings in Jack McInerney I think that's an upgrade from Max Arruti he brings in Jermaine Taylor that's an upgrade because he's more versatile than Paparato they lose Villafania they lose Rodney Wallace um, but I think Esprit in the playoffs showed that he can play uh, left back's a question but I think the moves were calculated very smart and for the first time for Caleb Porter he didn't need to make any big moves, and he can see how the team goes until July 1st, August 1st, and then make another one. I think they have a real chance. I do. I do think left back is a, uh, a big question mark. I think Villafania really turned it up, especially in MLS Cup. But I, I, you know, if I'm a Portland Timbers fan, if I'm Mary Paulson, I'm confident in Gavin Wilkinson. I'm confident in Caleb Porter making the right decision, and they'll fill that need. I just think that's the one spot that maybe stops them. Otherwise, the three in the midfield, Chara, Nagby, Valeri, they're arguably the best three midfielders in the league.